to head into the Marxism conference. You, you won't believe this, but there's an actual conference where people talk about how to overthrow democracy and capitalism and implement uh, an ideology that's killed millions upon millions of people. But one of the people that they're supporting, one of their idols, is a man by the name of Che Guevara. So today, we're going to try and give him some uh, information um, that states that uh, Che Guevara is not a social justice warrior like they like to proclaim. He's actually a racist. He hated Africans. He thought that they were below Europeans. So we're going to go in there and let them know how racist their ideology is, considering that they come to all of our events and call us racist for critiquing our religion. So this is an actual racist. This is their hero. And let's show them what's what. Catch us. So, ladies and gentlemen, as you can see, we are currently at the um, Marxist 2018 event, and we are talking about Che Guevara, this hero of the left, hero that is racist, is homophobic, and, oh, mate, it's so funny that, you know, there's one set of laws for um, the left and another set of laws for everyone else. So keep tuned and hopefully um, you can see exactly what the left is like at these events. Right, so. Yeah, so you're going to have to keep doing that. Yeah. If you're going to do live, it's going to be unexciting. It's just going to be us standing there for most of the time. Yeah. Because huh. I'm going to go home and edit this shit. You're not still alive, are you? Oh, kind of am. Huh? Kind of am. But it's one person. <laughs> I'll take the live a little bit later, actually, because, I mean, there's not much going on right now. But the moment shit starts hitting the fan, then you'll be here to witness it no, straight away. Here, actually, alive. no, I'll stay alive. Right. Right. Why not? And we're off. Fucking hell. Oh, man, I can smell the left from here. So when we're going in, so when we're going there, um, are we basically there's their sessions ending and other ones beginning? Is it? Or? It's all a park that happens, but they're in there now. So we're going to do it. We're going to go in. Oh. We're at least going to try and go. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We'll see how far we get. Well, I mean, under their ideology, they can't stop us because it is public property. <laughs> Everything's owned by the state. Including them, I just want to know. This is the arts, Victoria of the arts. Oh. Yeah, look, I want to know when they plan on moving to North Korea. Well, or if they've ever them. thought about it. We're going to ask them, mate. <laughs> they hate Australia so much, they hate capitalism, they hate all this system. Why don't they just go to North Korea? Yeah. Or Venezuela? Look, this is one question I've always wanted to ask them is um, how many South Koreans do you see trying to escape into North Korea? Um, I think there was one. <laughs> But he was uh, retarded. <laughs> you have to be. Fucking hell. Also, I want to ask him, um, what did I like most about North Korea? The lack of freedom or the lack of food? <laughs> that's a hard one. Yeah. Well, that's the funny thing here. This Che Guevara. Yeah. He hates the media. And he's uh -huh. quoted as saying in his diary, we must eliminate all papers, all news, we cannot make it ever um, revolution with a free press. <laughs> so these are the same people who complain that um, we had no free press in Australia. Yeah. But they're the same ones that like to go against independent media as much as possible. Oh my god. Alright, so we're getting closer. Someone cue the Jaws music. Oh, there's the police already. Yep. Here's the police. <laughs> I should really fucking have a selfie stick or something going on for me. <laughs> oh, we'll just head into the uh, Victoria College of the Arts. There's already police here. We'll check it out. We'll see if we can get in.
get ready, get ready for this shit. <sighs> Alright, so here come the police. Yeah. On their way. They've seen us. Yeah, full, full. Oh, yeah, no, that's good. Big up, boys. Oh, yeah. Okay, then, bye. So I'd like That's to. That's the police move away. I'd like to note, the Victorian College of the Arts is the art being an idiot. Is that the arts? Because it seems to host a conference that we want to destroy this country, Oof, mate. <laughs> they'd have to, they'd have to have a few screws loose off the top. And if that's an art to them, then they've got a fucking master's degree. This is the place here, isn't it? Oh, has to be. I don't see much advertising for the um, for the actual thing, though. <laughs> this is why you shouldn't have more. Got his awesome hoodie on, Senator Slayer. <laughs> what is that music? So I'm wondering if that, um, oh, it's probably a music class or something. Alright, so we're here at the College of the Arts. Question is, exactly which door is Centre it? For in, Centre for Indigenous Arts. So we're at the wrong, the wrong left wing arts building. Uh. It's here. We're just going to go around. I think that's why the, uh, you saw the police race off down that way. Indigenous Centre for the Arts. I'm Indigenous. There you go, Chief. I'm trying to get into the uh, Marxism Forum. How do I get in through here? Are you Chief? I recognise you. You're a Marxist, aren't you? How do you feel about Che Guevara being a racist? Ever thought of moving to North Korea? Did you know Che Guevara hates it up? Yes. <sighs> it's funny they hold a public event but they don't want to talk. That's the funny thing about it. <laughs> we'll go around where the coppers go. I love how they wave signs in the streets, they do public events, but then when a camera's in their face and they're getting attention, <laughs> they're gone. Look, I, I know that chick, I've seen her before. <laughs> yeah. and, uh, I think she's seen you before too. <laughs> yeah, I know. Uh, she's definitely a mark. <laughs> yeah. But she didn't want to hear about Che Guevara's racism. Oh no, of course not. So, she's off to a safe space again. She's off to a safe space. <laughs> Oh, wow. We could have read the signs. <laughs> I don't read anything written in pink. <laughs> Coming for you. Oh. 
All you have to do is just follow the bad smells and then you'll get there. Hey, get the cameras ready, oh, guys. Here we go. Hey, Booby, get the camera ready. Put it up like this. All right, guys, this is where things are about to get interesting, to say the least. Let's hope I can keep a firm grip on my phone. Hey, can you hold this? So we're holding the uh, posters or the flyers. So we're going to see uh, these people believe that um, racism is actually bad, or if it is. Uh, no, no, they're get, they're going. They're, they're they're on their way, like away from us now. They've just seen you, and I was like, "Oh fuck!" <laughs> oh, they got a megaphone. <sighs> Everyone, block your ears, because there's about to be a megaphone in our faces. those magnificent examples of the African race who have maintained their racial purity thanks to their lack of an affinity with bathing. That is racism. You support a racist. Have seen their territory invaded by a new kind of slave. You support racism. It's pretty clear cut. So you, you rally against us in the streets calling us racists for being critique, critiquing a religion and yet you support an outright racist against Africans. Nothing to say? See, they have nothing to say. They're a bunch of cowards. You don't care that Chase... It was a homophobe too. I didn't put that in this. It was a homophobe and a racist. Your hero. Oh, you look angry, buddy. You look angry. Are you okay? I, I think I can see steam coming out of your ears. Are you angry because you just found out that Jay was actually KKK? Is that why, is that why you get angry? <coughs> you know, it's a well-known fact that Jay was racist. So you people standing here in support of Che Guevara are absolutely disgusting. Absolutely reprehensible. You people stand and support an outright racist. He, he, he almost should be David Duke. You're a support of David Duke. You support an Adolf Hitler. Cowards, that's cowards for you. Cowards, you're all loud in the streets, but when it comes to information about your heroes, you shut up, you don't say anything. You support that bar. Do you want to overthrow democracy? Do you want to overthrow capitalism? Do 
Blue Bray will take him out. Blue Bray will take him out. He's not a very nice guy. Seems to bag out blacks in Africa. The black is an indolent and a dreamer, spending his meagre wage on frivolity or drink. He's almost David Duke. Do you support this guy? Chay is KKK. Chay is KKK. We're here as patriots to prevent you from furthering this racist agenda. Patriots are welcome and racists are not. So we're telling you you're not welcome in Melbourne with your racist bigotry in your books supporting this David Duke character. See, as you know, these communists, they're outright cowards. They're willing to scream in the streets when they outnumber people by 200 to 1. But when they're here, you know, probably outnumbering us by 6, they're cowards. They can't say anything. Look, she's even got a megaphone. Can't even say anything. Because they know, they know I'm right about Che Guevara. Che is KKK. And they so know go. And Che is gay as well. That's a fact as well. A homophobic gay man. They're getting reinforcements because they're too cowardly to have a dialogue. Are you angry with Che? Are you angry that your Lord and Saver was actually a racist? <coughs> It says right here in his personal diary that he was a racist, he hated Africans. He was homophobic as well, and a mass murderer, I know that doesn't worry us, but he was actually a racist as well. I'm sure that could worry us. Do you think Africans spend all their money on booze? Because that's what Che thinks. Che thinks that Africans don't bathe. Are you angry and upset about finding out that Che, your leader, is uh, actually a racist? A racist welcome. You look angry. Are you angry at Che? You are, aren't you? I'll be angry too with my way to was saying this kind of stuff. I'm against racism. It's like the steam's coming out of your ears too, mate. You alright? <laughs> Guys are usually tough when there's uh, faces in the street. What's going on? Nothing to say? The Ramones. How come you haven't got your Che Guevara t shirt on today? No Che? No Che? Did you know Che was KKK? It says here Che is KKK. <laughs> they used to lynch Africans in America. They used to kill them because of the colour of their skin. And Che agrees with this. Che says that Africans are stupid. Do you agree with Che? How, how do you think Che will feel about you? Che would be happy you did that. Because Che believes that Europeans are more advanced than Africans. Are you going to do it? Are you going to do it more than Jackson? You can take skills and get skin graphs as well. You can do it. Che didn't say anything about rainies. I think you're alright. I've seen you before. How are you? Che like Asians? Che like Asians? Do you reckon Che supports homosexuality? Bunch of hypocrites.
just get close ups of their faces. <coughs> Actually, get a close-up. I have to use it to the face. So I can mark them as races. Yeah, trolling. Oh, you got that one? Yeah, I got that one. Alright. You got that one? Alright. I'll get a side profile. I'll get the ears. You got the ears? You got the ears, yeah. Alright, get this one. Uh, She's very scary. active. Not enough, though. He's hanging down. Shame. Did Shay believe in uh, fat shaming? I wonder if he did. I wonder if it was a fat shamer. What do you reckon? <laughs> oh, no, I'm shame. He definitely was. Did he judge people on crazy eyes? I wonder if he did. I don't know. You look like you have crazy eyes too. Thanks for watching that one. Do you reckon he judged people on their, their music, um, the music they listen to? Rainbows and Unicorn ones. Well, he did judge people on their, their skin colour. So. Oh. I don't know what colours are you two. Do you reckon he judged um, chicks who had pink or purple hair? Definitely. <coughs> Shay is KKK. I think he'd be jealous of too much beard. You reckon? Yeah. He's jealous. He, he could never grow a real beard. That's yeah. why he'd be jealous of this place. That's just this one. Do you reckon he was against um, people with red hair? Oh, Gingers, yeah. I think, I think he thinks they don't have souls. Yeah, I reckon too. They don't believe in souls, so they could be right. Do you reckon you judge people because they're, I'd say dark skin, but I'd, I'd probably more so say ugly. Yeah, well, you yeah. know. Look at Choke, so. Yeah, some sort of mm. ugliness. You went to South America, didn't you? Do you reckon they judge Strong people on uh, being old? Do you reckon he was an ageist as well? <laughs> uh, yeah, well, yeah. He, if you were old and couldn't work, you'd probably with a tip. Yeah. It's very, they're very capitalist. Obviously. What about if you were Asian slash um, gender neutral, binary, lesbian, bi? What about that? Oh, he would have been confused at a fuck. Do you reckon he would have deported her? Uh, worse. Deportation costs money. Okay. They don't like to spend money. What about if you were shy and you wore big black dark sunglasses and wore like a red vest to prove that you were communist, but still you were non-binary? Uh, Chase is all sort of weird, kinky shit, so you know, that red stand out like a bull. What about if you were uh, Ranga and you have long hair and you basically um, were too scared to talk? Do you reckon you would judge someone like that? Oh yeah, he didn't like pussies. What about if you uh, had blue eyes and earrings? Oh. And you're a man, you had an earring in the right ear. Because he was a homophobe. And oh. those earrings had, zoom in on them, flowers on them. Flowers. Do you reckon uh, Che would have been a discriminate, dis discriminate, how do you say? Discrimination Discrim against discriminatory for his um, um, pro homosexual agenda. Buzzword, buzzword, buzzword. It's very interesting, so. Where's Ross? So is this how they're going to march when they march everyone into the gulags? Is this, they're going to stand like this and start putting us in the gulags to, to execute us? Because you know communism has killed over 20 plus million people. It's never worked. What do you, mean? you can call it socialism, you can call it what you want. It's never worked. But these people, they always pick the weakest of the cult. So I'll look at these people here and I'll say, these aren't going to be doctors. All right, I, can, I can just pick that right now. They're not going to be doctors, they're not going to be um, scientists. They're basically the dudes that are sent to school by their rich parents and uh, basically what makes them their lives. Instead, they get a lip ring and they start uh, following Che Guevara, the racist. And then they go on the streets attacking patriots for trying to protect this nation. They call us racists, but they're the real racists. They have no meaning of the word. It's all buzzwords to them. It's all buzzwords. It's all racism, fascism, us small. Unless you're Che Guevara, of course, because then racism is acceptable. Yeah. Hey, he's tucking in his shirt. Get that on camera. Uh, uh, uh. Quick, he's tucking in his shirt. Does he have a, a communist flag underneath his shirt? Check it. Oh. 
You know what I was thinking about. Do you think mass murder is okay if it's against uh, capitalists? <coughs> White people, Christians, doesn't matter. Why can't we all just get along? That's what I want to know. Because you can't Why is there so stuff? much hate from these people? Yeah. You know? Capitalism's evil. Capitalism sucks. Well, you can go to North Korea. You just want to go to North Korea? Or Venezuela? Because it's actually been implemented correctly in Venezuela. Why don't you go there and like eat like um, rats that have run into your house or something? Because that's what you'll be living on. You'll be living on rats and scraps. Well, it's all right. You're a bunch of rats anyway. It doesn't work. Oh, he's the hamburger one. Oh, here he is. This ran too far. Has he found a missing jacket? Hey, Karen. How do you like Che Guevara? You like <coughs> Not talking smack now, are you? <laughs> <laughs> you found a missing jacket, buddy. Keep looking. Paul's out in here, Sue. Why don't you go home? Do something more constructive. Stephen Jolly's going to get two votes. 100% two votes. He's got really good. Dreamers. I thought you would be more excited. You should go stand in the city and paint yourselves grey and get money for like being statues and shit. You can make money off that. You can pretend you're a bowling ball. No. No. Racist like Chuck? I don't think so. Oh, that's something to do with war or you do Board. That's how open borders now. <coughs> open everybody's borders <coughs> for hours. In fact, they're not very open borders when it comes to South African yeah, right farmers. I thought farmers. you guys were against walls. I thought they were against walls, mate. Yeah, you're only wall. against walls when somebody else wants to build them. All walls are bad. Did you class us as Mexicans? Are you just being racist like Che? Never talked about Karl Marx. Never talked about Karl Marx. Hey, you know why they're not talking? Because Che hated the media as well. He said here, it says Che hates the media. So we he must hated. eliminate all newspapers. We cannot make a revolution without free speech. Uh -huh, Neil. Or with free speech, sorry. Yo. Someone wrote a pretty funny comment. Lol Trump wants to build oh get out of the way. <coughs> Lol Trump wants to build a wall and they knock him, yet they have a socialist wall there. Yeah, this is a socialist wall keeping out Mexicans. Patriot this is Mexicans. A communist wall, let's call it what it is. Mm, the borders yeah, are pretty close like North Korea. Oh, yeah. How many white guys use a red shirt? You can throw it out. At least take one today. Put it in your files. Okay, okay. <coughs> no, he turned away straight away on that one. What's your chance? Why do you lose your chance? Patriots are welcome, racists are not. Patriots are, are welcome, racists are not. not. Patriots are, are welcome, welcome, racists are not. Can I borrow someone's megaphone? No, I guess not. Uh, I thought it was popular state. Uh, the, uh, 
<laughs> Proves that. walls I work, guess. <laughs> <laughs> Proves walls work, I guess. So who fought up this tactic of just standing here? Because it actually makes us look weak and yell at them. Whoever fought up this tactic, you should remove as leader. Look at all these signs. It's all that's taken away. A rental by the day or something. Yeah. Looks like that's your size personal thing. They were rock childish, like a fight. Hey, mate, you know the game, you can't talk, you just spoke. Huh? You're gonna get reprimanded. Did the sheep They're gonna take you out the back of the Marxist headquarters and whip you. Did the sheep will kindly really say something? Oh, Bushes, let's make this a game. Whoever talks, off the mark, and I'll make sure I've got it into a dossier so you can read it later and you can whip them. I know you did the whip I know that. I wish I could put the play school music over this. Play school? Yeah. <coughs> hey, I busted you again, mate. I'm not going to tell you again. You can't be so talking in a silent protest. This is a wall to keep out free speech. No, I'm talking to you. Keep out ideas. So many dull, sad faces in this crowd. Have a scan of, of just the just the atmosphere here. Yeah, the rest of the world. Yeah, just a scan. You know this poor bloke here? Yeah. He had to move up his face off his time before he could change. That's what he's doing. He's bleak like Michael Jackson. Yeah, but he's happy, he don't give a shit. He huh? supports him 100 percent These guys what's you know, these other ones, I don't know, maybe 60, 70%. This guy kept talking. I don't think he's 100 percent on board. I know that bloke is up there. What? I got it right there. He is. Is that his cousin? And Kim Jong Un's cousin over there. Is that his cousin? Yeah, it's his cousin. You sure? Yeah, she's escaped, pretending to escape, and she's come to Australia to implement his uh, ideology here. That's what he comes to. The women yakel. She's smaller. Oh, yeah, she's smaller. Ah, she's smaller. Ask if she's a stronger basis. She's brown. I think it's When you get to this point, you should make a conscious effort to start shaving. Don't <coughs> give up, shave it. I mean, they just shave it right off. You know, who cares? No one cares, man. What is winning quality in your ear, bro? That's a good comment. <laughs> Oh, that's what is happened to the hamburger? The hamburger, yeah. she ate him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're gonna go. These are boring. Oh, oh, look who it is. Do you really think that we're oh, fascists? Yeah. Gerald, actually, we won't go yet. Not much, man. Just uh, troll on these uh, these comments. We're trying to I'm teach them that Che was actually a, a racist. Oh, right. well, someone spoke. Wait. Hey. Right. We're gonna go. Hey, Blair. Where's Blair? It's DBC. Looks angry. We don't, we don't beat people up. We don't do that. We just want to have a, a peaceful dialogue. I do believe that um, there should be a conservative forum. Do you reckon there should be a conservative forum? Actually, get, get a line of this. 
Go up. against the conservative form if you, if you have the chance? Would you support a conservative form? Would you support um, advanced hair? Yeah, yeah. Nah, I'm just joking. Would you support a conservative form? Would you support a conservative form? Would you support a conservative form? Do you support a conservative form? Or the TV show Queer Eye for Straight Dog? Do you support McDonald's being banned? Or a conservative form? Would you support um, a conservative form? I like this guy. I like this guy, he's actually cool. Dedication, dedication. All right, boys, I'll leave you alone. We're not coming back. We're going. All right, have a good day. Enjoy your free speech. See you. You have the right to remain silent. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> nah, not today. <laughs> no, I mean, but usually we used to do the UPF rather. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. You turn the camera off. That's right. Um, we used to do the UPF rather, and they used to come out to the streets <laughs> and protest. Well, very bold. Yeah. 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 As you can see, for the first time, the left has actually managed to shut the fuck up. It took them a while, but when they have reached that point, it's better to be, you know, to be silent and actually listen to people. But, you know, I don't think they were listening. I think they were just triggered by the fact that I'm speaking a language created by white people. But, um. Yeah, I guess it takes too much energy to talk, seeing they can't find the energy to work, how the fuck are they supposed to talk anyways? They had two megaphones there, but they couldn't be fucked using them. Seriously, they could shout me down, they could shout Neil down, everyone else, but they just chose, you know, and to be silent, and I think, I think that's awesome, to protect your safe space through silence. So thank you guys for tuning in and watching us, and have a good day. Bye. Thank you very much. Alright, see you later. See you later. Take care.